Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video I have very good news because finally Microsoft released a new build for the release preview channel in which the moment one update for Windows 11 22H2 is enabled by default. So that means that this build could be the moment one update for Windows 11 and also in this video I'm going to have a guess on the release date of the moment one update for Windows 11 22H2. The build that Microsoft released for the release preview channel is 22,621.6 and of course if you are enrolled in the release for your channel all you need to do is to go to windows update and then check for updates and you will have all the new features from the moment one update of windows 11 22h2 enabled by default in windows 11. i'm going to talk about more info about everything that is new and what you need to know about this new moment one update but before that please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's continue with the video. So I saw in the comments that a lot of users don't like the idea of modifying registries or running certain commands to enable different features earlier in Windows 11. So this video is a good news to those people because Microsoft is starting to enable those features to everyone in the release preview channel by default. So that means that this build will be the moment one update. And as I've said, I'm going to tell you at the end of the video when I think that this will be released according to previous releases of Windows 11 for the main release. Just a quick reminder, the moment one update for Windows 11 22H2 has the new tabs in the file explorer with nice little animations, features such as drag and drop, opening new tabs, switching between them and so on. We have the new open with menu which is really nice in Windows 11 22H2 and really nice rebranded to match the Windows 11 experience. We also have the new suggested actions when we copy a date or a phone number we have certain suggested actions. A new overflow menu on the taskbar when the taskbar gets full we have a new menu that pops up and helps you you have and get access to the icons that were overflowed and also in the file explorer we have some new features regarding sharing files to more devices we can discover and share to more devices including desktops using a nearby sharing and that is pretty pretty nice now if you ask me about the release date my guess would be the 25th of October because Microsoft is usually releasing the updates for the main release with the new features on the last Tuesday of each month so I think that would be the date that the moment I want to update would be released for the main release and most likely this will be the date in my opinion if you have other opinions don't forget to leave them in the comments below and i'm sure that everyone will be glad to hear from you so this is all there is to it microsoft finally enabled by default all the new features basically the moment one update for the users that are enrolled in the release preview channel and that means that by the end of the month on the 25th we should have the moment one update officially rolled out to all the users on the main release of windows 11 22h2 if you enjoyed this video don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one i was emmanuel from tech base until next time have a nice day